we come to our first uh, cabin <coughs> in Golar Wars. I don't know what this is called. Or there's no signage or anything. But uh, it's an old mining cabin. You can see the mines up there somewhere. And uh, yeah, so really cool. This has been a very beautiful drive up into here. So we'll walk through the cabins here. And uh, take a look at this all. Huh. So this is the first cabin. There's three buildings all together on this property. This is the inside of this one. Pretty cool. I don't know if this is a workshop or what it was for sure. Did have electric. Looks like probably from the what do you think? 60s, 70s, probably 60s or 50s. Some of that looks pretty old up there. Yeah, I'm gonna say 50s because of the porcelain insulators for sure. You guys can comment down below to see, you know, put your own opinion or what it was. Okay, this is a Keystone Mine. Somebody's got it put on here. <laughs> it says, welcome, but enter at your own risk. So, very cool. I will always have that view. Yeah, that I view's, so that is amazing. There are bees. So, be very careful. Old fridge. This baby's right up against the rock wall here. But look at that view, like my wife said. Wouldn't that be awesome to wake up to every morning? Come true. Yeah. Got lots of windows in here. Yeah, I'd be careful with those bees over there. I don't know if those are African. Yeah, yeah I'll be careful though. So we'll probably drive down to the other one here a little bit. junk here. Pretty cool. There's a look down into the canyon. We just come up and the road keeps on going, of course. And, uh, the, uh, the end of our trip will be at Barker Ranch. That's uh, where we're headed today.
there. All right, I'll be back with you in a little bit. So we made it to the Barker Ranch. Creepy, but a beautiful place. Let's see what the sign has to say over here. Family getaway. Barker Ranch was built by recreational ranchers who moved to the desert to enjoy solitude and simplicity of living from civilization. Butch and Helen Thompson moved to the area in the late 1930s to try their hand at gold mining. Around 1940, they constructed a small stone cabin in the outbuildings with electricity provided by a windmill and generator, drinking water from a nearby spring. In 1955, the ranch was sold, was sold to Jim Arlen Barker, who moved to the desert from Oklahoma to accommodate their family gatherings in Baker's in Barker's enlarged the house and constructed more outbuildings. The ranch became infamous in 1969 when Charles Manson and members of the Manson family were captured at the site. Family members attracted the attention of local law enforcement when they were suspected of burning a piece of road maintenance equipment. Detectives later discovered that the vandalism suspects were also responsible for a series of murders in the Los Angeles area. Barker Ranch became part of Death Valley National Park in 1994. Tragically, the main house and workshop were destroyed in an accidental fire in May 2009. Quite a story. The first one of the guys that took this over, the second guy, was from Oklahoma. He got here to the desert. Kind of like us. <laughs> cool area, picnic tables. And then here was the main house. I bet it was pretty cool back in the day looking. It really wasn't very big. It was very small, actually. Donkey in the distance. And this, I think, I don't think they lived in it. I th think. It was just a workshop, but I'm not sure. Did you sign it? Mm -mm. Not going to.
I guess those were chicken coops. Looks like this might be a water catchment or something. Not sure. And that is it, guys.